The Pirate Bay is back. The controversial downloading site reappeared on the internet Saturday after authorities closed it late last year. Its pirate ship icon has been replaced with a phoenix for the moment. But it appears whoever's running the site has locked almost all of the original staff out of the site's back end. Now they've decided to jump ship. Peer-to-peer -peer news site Torrent Freak reports those staffers will be launching their own version of the Pirate Bay. The last time the internet saw the official Pirate Bay was December 9th, when police in Stockholm raided its server and shut the site down. Now, the site looks almost exactly as it did when it vanished, a demonstration of how, given enough computer resources and willpower, the site is basically impossible to kill. It's thanks in part to the nature of torrent traffic. The Pirate Bay itself only keeps a relatively lightweight collection of what are known as magnet links, which are like addresses that point to the actual content, stored in little chunks distributed across the peer-to-peer -peer network. And The Verge says since 2012, the Pirate Bay has been hosted on a series of virtual servers. There isn't a single server room that holds the Pirate Bay as we know it. Those hosting providers also don't know they're hosting Pirate Bay content. Site admins told Torrent Freak the Pirate Bay uses what's called a load balancer to handle internet traffic into and out of its servers. TechSpot explains it has the side effect of masking server activity from outsiders. This arrangement also provides those hosts with some deniability. The load balancer's masking keeps their IP addresses from ever being linked to Pirate Bay traffic. The Pirate Bay even sits on a collection of backup domain names, so if authorities seize the piratebay.se again, the site can set up shop in some other country. It's done it before. In 2013, the site went through six different home countries. Speaking of new shops, those old staffers who struck out on their own haven't yet detailed where or when they plan to open the new site. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrews.